Hi Libra, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Libra with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see what's going on for you this week. How is Libra? Com okay, coming into the week. Three of Swords. Hmm. Maybe feeling isolated. Uh, maybe from somebody that you like or that you love. F feeling a bit of alienation. Maybe there's lack of communication here. Or there was some misunderstanding. Miscommunication. Misinterpretation. It could be a divorce. I heard impending divorce. Yeah. With the judgment card here, it's like somebody's got to make a decision here. It's in decision mode. Or it's in decision it's in the process of a decision being made. You could be dealing with another air sign. Some of you just trying to stay in something, trying to relive or revive something. Maybe there's an energy of wanting to, somebody wants to divorce, separate, and there's somebody here, could be Scorpio, trying to revive or relive this or put more, breathe, breathe life into it. What is the advice for Libra? The Six of Swords, whoa. All right, so it's either that you're gonna reconcile with your person or you're gonna maybe reconcile and move on. Whatever you do, you need to keep it to yourself. There is some, a level of deception going on around you, either from you or from your person. There's somebody masquerading like, like I'm really committed, like I'm really for this relationship, like I'm really for you, but it's something else. Somebody's trying hard not to get caught. And this could even be snooping around. Well, all of these swords coming up, this is a trial. This is a test. Um, it's like the universe is saying, look, do you still want this or do you not? Because we could take you somewhere else. You know, we could bring in and usher in a better energy for you. With the six of swords, it says, with that being advice, release the... The hurt from previous relationships makes sense of moving on. Does it make sense? Be rational in your choice. It says it's a choice here. So even if you choose to move forward alone, you could always go backwards. It's not a decision to where you're really cutting ties or severing ties with a particular person, place, or thing. But you've got to make the choice to move forward. And if this person catches up with you, if they want to change, if they want to show up in a different capacity, that's always a choice too. So it's not like you're really putting this person out of your life. Because there's a lot of anxiety here, a lot of overthinking, a lot of sleepless and restless night. There could even be some pain within your body or your heart. Um, you got to determine what you're going to do. Are you staying in this? Somebody takes you to a level of overthinking. What is the outcome here? What is the outcome for labor? What is the outcome for labor? What is the outcome for labor? The Knight of Pentacles. So maybe um, I got to clarify that. Let me see. You could get a more committed relationship here with the Knight of Pentacles showing up. Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, uh, a relationship could take a turn, put more work into it, more effort into it. After you move on, after you decide to keep moving forward and you don't stay stuck, you could get another relationship. The Eight of Pentacles talks about marriage later in life. The Knight of Pentacles talks about a more committed way of existing, dedicated, devoted to. What is, what is Libra going to be dedicated and devoted to? It could even be learning about yourself or being about yourself or putting some more energy time into yourself healthy living also is what I'm hearing knight of wands in the chariot so it's like maybe you're gonna take some fast action to move make a home move home purchase does it make sense to move to start something new a new relationship or, or buy a new home
the eight of pentacles and the knight of wands and the chariot it's like you're gonna be really self-focused self-directed some of you gonna work on yourself and maybe work on your fitness and start to get really strong in your fitness and losing weight or maintaining a level of weight that is healthy for you this is exercise and weight this is also putting more time into yourself pampering yourself with the empress card you might get a message of concern with that three of swords there maybe that it causes some friction it causes for something to change it is temporary though yeah somebody is leaving somebody's in bad health or somebody's trying to leave bad health here change their bad health this could even be somebody saying look you're too overweight or you're too this or too that or if someone makes a comment and now you just like this could even be baby weight or mom because we got the mom coming up so it's just like maybe you're just going to get into more of a fitness regimen here because this talks about gaining weight fast and you're losing it fast I don't know if somebody sees you on social media or somebody sees you in your community and they maybe they allude to your weight gain or your some people could even call it happy weight and and that prompts you to move yeah it's like you want to come out of like i don't know feeling not good about yourself and also maybe stop drinking okay that could be for you or someone around you so it just looks like libra is in a place of oh also you're thinking about getting surgery do you want to go under the knife does it make sense to go under the knife or do it the hard way and lose the weight and be more dedicated committed to losing the weight doing something over and over again wash words repeat all right so this is weight loss and weight gain whatever for you you do have a wealthy man in your life that could maybe even provide you or you are the wealthy man or woman provide you with um the money to do whatever it is you want to do you know with your body some of you going to be occupied with yeah it's like do i just go under the knife take this money some of you are in a relationship you could be getting married or this person or you're already married this person wants to marry you or they want to be with you for a really long time so or you're already married maybe you have some reservations about the relationship here you're expecting for this person to be better do something different yeah you were expecting for them to have more money or more prestige you thinking about if you married someone else or you were with someone else this is what i have for you if it resonates go over to the website book there ask a question or two by texting your question to the number below you can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy l a coffee link you can catch me live every tuesday thursday and sunday night 9 30 p.m eastern standard time thank you guys many blessings to you take care